Okay, good day folks, Stephen Dupria here. I just wanted to take a quick minute and just demonstrate uh, some functional leg strength uh, with athletic range of motion, all right? So we're gonna do that in a front stance uh, as well as in a wide athletic stance like a horse stance. I just wanted to demonstrate um, just sitting down on your, on your stance, which is commonly done in martial arts training, which is very useful. So what you want to do is find nice even weight distribution in your, in your feet. Open up the hips. Breathe, engage the glutes, tuck the pelvis a little bit. Just want to engage the muscles in the, the pelvis, in the hip sockets, in the glutes, going down into the back of your hamstrings. From here, you want to shift forward and back. Okay, so sinking back, I should be able to sit on either of my legs. So here I'm kind of sitting in between them, but if I want to sit back on one leg, it be here. And this is like this is one variation. Okay, from here, if I want to go back up, I can take a long way up. I can go, so let's sit on the front leg just for contrast quickly. So going down, I should be able to sit on this leg and lift my back. Okay, so weight is here. Then I can go up. Okay, I can also sit back. Move my front. Sit back here. And then rock forward to the middle. Come up. Down. All the way through. Back. Up. Switch quickly. Take this view. So you want to find a position where you can shift your weight. So okay, I can sit on this leg, I can sit on that leg. Okay, so I sit back, come up, sit forward, come up, sit back, shift forward, come up. So I'm in the midpoint, I can shift all the way through. Okay, so that is functional range of motion, so joint range of motion and functional kinetic linking uh, in the front stance. Having a quick look at a wide athletic stance like a horse stance, this would be more like a Kazakh squat. So hopefully you can see my feet. Okay, so take a wide squat position, and then you want to drop your weight down, keeping your spine and your chest up. And you can let the foot come up and point up. Okay, and you want to try not round in this position. You want to try and maintain a vertical spine. And you can go straight up and over. So there's a switch. Okay. And a variation of this would be a low transition. Yeah, uh, you can do, so this will stretch predominantly into the hamstring. If you place the foot down, start getting more of an abductor stretch. Yeah. Okay. So I just wanted to demonstrate, uh, yeah, those athletic functional range of motion exercises that are commonly overlooked. And if you're a serious athlete, or martial artist, or even just an average Joe looking to improve their health and function, it'll help you conceptualize what the body's designed to actually do. We're meant to be able to transition from floor positions to various standing positions. And our joints are meant to be able to do this functionally in many different ways, and that helps provide health. When you have function, you derive health. Us.